Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. This is Peter Drury, and next to me providing insights will be Jim Beglin. Thanks for the intro, Peter. I've been soaking up the atmosphere, and I'm really looking forward to what lies in store. So off we go then. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Well, I can't bypass Cristiano Ronaldo. He knows how to get the job done because he's got the lot. I know I need to be careful about bias, but I really hope we see all the skills from him and, and that he puts on a show for us. I think the opposition defence agree too. He's going to be the source of so many of their headaches. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Looks like a good ball through. Pepe. Bale. With the ball through. Modric. Hit into the middle. Oh, that's not going to find its target. Aimed long and direct. Plays it out to the wing. And he's onside. Too long and over the line. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Real Madrid getting forward at times, but achieving little of substance. Marcelo looking for options. Marcelo Cristiano Ronaldo Goal! Real Madrid! That's always a great sight, you know, on a football pitch. Nimble footed, show great balance and a really cool head to finish. And that kind of dribbling is really smart. Real Madrid take the lead, 1-0. Oh, look, it's lovely having a player with such ability in your side. He's always capable of coming up with something important, and he's done it again. Too much on it, and that's the keepers. Well, this man's contribution is, as you would expect, proving terrific. Well, having that sort of player in your side is reassuring because the rest of the team knows he can make his influence count at any stage. It's simply part of his package. When he really wants to, this fella scores. Chance to shoot! Gets it back. Hits one! Saved only by poor finishing. I think when you're in front of the goal like that, you really should do better. That's a poor finish in the end. Real Madrid are seeing a lot of the ball and have a 1-0 lead to show for it. Tries a through ball. Flags up. Cut 
takes it out. So they got the only goal to give them a 1-0 lead. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Modric out to the flank. He's in space and looking for options. Chris, really well taken goal. And they are disappearing out of sight. And that is a fabulous Real Madrid goal. Well, look, Real Madrid have evolved into a more possession-focused outfit under different management, but they still retain that lethal breaking power. That's why he costs so much money. How do you stop him when he's in full flight like that? Impossible. Real Madrid get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Daniel Carvajal. Bale. Now here's the through ball. Played out wide. And the flag has stayed down. Looking to shoot. That is wayward. Right in front of the goal like that, and he's gone and missed it. I won't have to tell him that's not good enough. Tony Kroos. James Rodriguez. Benzema. Now the pass. It's a brilliant interception. And it's Carla Hal. Promising cross. And more and more and more. Hot knife through butter. They have done it again. Oh, the cross was inch perfect, and the header unerring. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. He snaffles his third, and that earns him the match ball. Well, he's been the outstanding player on the pitch, and devastating in front of the goal. What a display, what a player. Real Madrid take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Bale takes it over to the other flank. Here it comes. And the finish! It's come loose. And it's another assault on goal. Surely. A chance here! No mistake! They're back within reach! Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. Well, the penalty box usually is the place where you get least time on the ball, and yet they were able to exchange passes before an unchecked finish, and I mean, to be honest with you, that should open up an inquest. So, is this the start of a comeback? Modric 
passes it through. Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. I think there's always that danger that the defence can get exploited in that way. That must have served as a real wake-up call to them. It's Modric! Oh, not the best of headers. certain that won't get through and the referee brings the first half to a close Real Madrid head in for half time with a 3-1 lead Underway again. Modric is making a foray down the right. Forward it goes. Looks to slip it through. And here's the chance to counter. Well read, he sorted that out. Isco. Out to the left it goes. Progress he's made on the ball. And he's pulled him up for that challenge. And that's going to be a booking. Tries a through ball, and shoots! It's in! And the second half is off to a flyer! Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Well, we've just seen intelligent football from intelligent footballers. That's honed on the training ground, and lovely when it comes off on match day. We have got ourselves a game here. Well, I think they probably needed an early goal in this half just to give them the confidence and belief to push on and look for an equaliser. That really should have hit the net. again for a throw-in thrust towards the front line now the pass going for goal what about it well we're all back to square one but I hope this game opens up from here it looks as if it could happen really outwitted one-on-one -on -one. once more he gets the better of the keeper I just thought he was alert and direct. There was no messing about. He was too quick for the keeper, and that's a fine finish.
We have ourselves a real game here. Well, that's got them back in it, but it'll be very interesting to see what way they approach it now. Do they settle for that or push for more? Goal! Real Madrid! And they get themselves in front! He was urged to shoot, and he duly delivered. Well, considering he has a bit of a, a shoot-on-sight policy, he was the one player that should have been picked up then. It was both careless and costly from where I'm sitting. Real Madrid get themselves into the lead. Listen, it's no surprise to me as to who scored the goal. When you look through this team, he's the standout performer with a, a whole repertoire of different talents. He'll do for me every time. It's a loose ball. Real Madrid still contemplating when to use their last remaining substitute. Puts it into the middle. Well, it's certainly livened things up a bit, and that next goal now is absolutely crucial. And as soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. This has become one superb game of football. Oh, this is real tit for tat stuff. It's difficult to see. Modric has been caught there. It's a foul. it through the shot's on it's there and the comeback is complete and that is about as cool as they come he picked his spot expertly well I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Real Madrid have decided now is the time to make their final change. Katira. Bale. Looks like a good ball through. Cristiano Ronaldo! 
It's a goal! Real Madrid are level. A lovely header, but really, it was all about the delivery. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. Four in the game, he is the man. This is quite a battle. Oh, look, I love watching games like this when both teams are given everything they've got to try and win it. This is all the makings of a cracker. It's gone out for a throw-in. Looks to slip it through. Out towards the flank. Balls come loose, and the chase is on. Isco. It's Marcelo. Crunching tackle. That's a throw. Intercepts the throw. That's well read. This is intriguing. Next goal critical. Yes, and what a battle this has been. Neither is showing any sign of backing off. It's a tribute to wonderful attitude to put everything they've got into attempting to gain that vital edge. They really need to start moving the ball forward with pace at this late stage of the game. Tries to get it forward quickly. There's no flag! It really is now or never. They need a goal, however it comes. Carries far too far and out of play. Tony Kroos. Kadira. Rafael Varane. Cutting down that right flank. Now the pass. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Foul free kick. Tony Cross. Four added minutes on the board. Goes direct to the front line. Tony Cruz, Cristiano Ronaldo. Ball is over the line. Tony Cruz, if we're going to get a winner, it's got to come now. Cruz, that is a terrific run. He's delivered all right, and look who gets the final say. And it's no accident when this kind of thing happens. Top players are elevated to such a level because they have the will to keep going and the composure to produce vital goals. Take that. Tony Crowes showed real composure then. I mean, how often do you see a player do everything right until he gets into the box only to completely kind of fluff the finish? Not him.
Real Madrid complete their comeback and now they only need to hold out. And that is it, the referee has seen enough. A huge result, a place in the next round is theirs to lose now. Success on away territory, a lead to protect at home, it is looking really good. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Look, I wondered as to whether they'd be able to pull off a, an away triumph, but I won't be doing that again in a hurry. And I was really taken by their positivity and belief, so it's a big well done from me.